Before the year's most talked about movie, The Interview, came out, the critics had given it a mixed reception. Then came the Sony hack and threats against any cinema that showed it and its withdrawal. It looked likely it would lose Sony its $80 million production and marketing budget. Very really? However, since Sony backtracked and released it as video on demand on the web on Christmas Eve, it's taken 15 million on the internet alone, and the 300 cinemas of its restricted release have been sold out. A wider release, perhaps to 10 times that number of screens, is surely on the cards. The film has gone from being a potential black hole in the entertainment giant's budget to box office gold. It's a farce of the highest level. I would equate it to something like Airplane or Hot Shots, you know? Overall, big dumb fun. Super funny, super funny. I thought it was a great movie. It was really funny. They did a fantastic job. Rarely has a film benefited from such an amount of free publicity and like Chaplin's great dictator years before, not even condemnation from a national government's been able to stop the interview. Which, unlike Chaplin's masterpiece, has not suffered from appeasement or much criticism of its politics. Unless it's from within North Korea. Indeed, while Kim Jong-un's a movie fan and is likely to have seen it, he's kept his silence. President Barack Obama chose to make freedom of speech his reason for intervening criticizing Sony for bowing to North Korean pressure. That tipped the balance and got the cash registers ringing. Imagine if producers and distributors and others start engaging in self-censorship because they don't want to offend the sensibilities uh, of somebody whose sensibilities probably need to be offended. With publicity like that, the movie would have to be a real dog to fail. The interview is no dog, and it hits its admittedly soft target with ease, time and time again. Out. Hmm? Take him out. Like for drinks? Like to dinner? Take him out in the town? No, uh, take him out. You want us to kill the leader of North Korea? Yes. 